Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover what cube roots are. This will be an introduction to cube roots. Let's jump into number one, where we have a two and an eight. Now, in order to understand cube roots, we're going to start by looking at cubing a number, which means we have an exponent of three. For example, let's start with two cubed. So two with an exponent of three. This means two times two times two, which equals eight. So two cubed equals eight. Again, two cubed, that means two times two times two. Two times two equals four times two equals eight. Now going off of two cubed, let's move on to looking at a cube root. Now a cube root is the inverse of cubing a number, which means the opposite of cubing a number. We are going in reverse, so to speak. We need to think what number multiplied by itself three times will equal the number under the cube root symbol. For example, let's find the cube root of eight. So what number multiplied by itself three times will equal eight? Well, two, the cube root of eight is two. So again, the cube root of eight equals two. So we can see the relationship there. Two cubed equals eight, and then the cube root of eight equals two. Let's move on to number two and take a look at another example. We have five and 125. Let's start by cubing five. So five cubed, and that does equal 125. So five cubed, that means five times five times five, which again equals 125. Five times five equals 25 times five gives us that 125. Now let's find the cube root of 125. So what number multiplied by itself three times will equal 125? Well, five. Five is the cube root of 125. So the cube root of 125 is five. So to recap number two, five cubed equals 125. Five times five times five. The cube root of 125 is five because we know five multiplied by itself three times will equal that 125. So we can see the relationship there between five cubed and the cube root of 125. Let's move on to numbers three and four where we have two examples of cube roots. Starting with number three where we have the cube root of 64. So what number cubed will equal 64? Well, four, four cubed equals 64. Four times four, times four. Four times four equals 16 times four equals 64. So the cube root of 64 is four. We need to think what number multiplied by itself three times will equal the number under the cube root symbol. Lastly, let's move on to number four where we have the cube root of 27. So what cubed equals 27? Three, three cubed equals 27. Three times three times three. Three times three equals nine times three equals 27. So the cube root of 27 is three. So there you have it. There's a basic introduction to cube roots. Just remember, what number multiplied by itself three times will equal the number under the cube root symbol. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.